Knowing the differences between heparin and warfarin is a super high yield topic that you need to know, and it's one of the most confusing things that will always trip you up in exams. Let's make it easy. Let's take a look at the Picmonic for Warfarin, or the War Fairy, shooting across the scene here for this international incident. War Fairy! Ah. No? Pretty much heparin and warfarin are all indicated for atrial fibrillation and to prevent things, you know, like v DVTs and venous thrombosis. As with every anticoagulant, it's pretty obvious that you need to watch for bleeding. But what's super important about the difference between warfarin and heparin is what? Warfarin is absolutely contraindicated in pregnancy, and you can remember that here by this pregnant lady wrapped in caution tape. Now, what's super important is that you've got to monitor what when you have a patient taking warfarin. Well, you have to monitor PT and INR, and you can remember it by looking right here at this international building. Warfarin has a prolonged therapeutic onset, or this long onset switch. That means it takes a while after you've started taking the medication to reach a therapeutic level. And what are you monitoring? Well, remember, PTINR, don't forget that. It's also really important to remember to inform your patients to maintain the same diet, especially those green leafy vegetables which are high in vitamin K. Warfarin has two antidotes, vitamin K and fresh frozen plasma. And as you can see right here in our Pygmonic, we have our Viking King and our fresh frozen plasma screen TV. Now, let's contrast that with heparin, or the hippie heron inside of Pygmonic. It's so easy to contrast this entire drug with this entirely different image. Now, again, same thing, indications for DVT, pulmonary embolism. Now, what's important to remember to monitor with heparin? Well, it's APTT, or active partial thromboplastin time. And what about pregnancy? Well, heparin is safe for pregnancy, and you can see it here as this really weirdly drawn pregnant chip with a safe for safe for pregnancy. What side effect is really worrisome with heparin? Well, heparin-induced thrombocytopenia, or a decrease in platelets. You've got to remember what important drug is an antidote to heparin? Well, protamine sulfate. And you can remember that here as this potato man with a sulfur match. So one more time, let's contrast the differences between heparin and warfarin. So warfarin, or the war fairy, is contraindicated in pregnancy. Remember that you need to monitor PT and INR. Remember that warfarin has a prolonged therapeutic onset, and you need to teach your patients to maintain the same diet. And the antidotes, remember vitamin K and fresh frozen plasma. So let's look at heparin, or the hippie heron. You need to monitor APTT. It's safe for pregnancy. It's instantly therapeutic. And don't forget about that daunting side effect, heparin-induced thrombocytopenia, as well as the antidote, protamine sulfate. Everything we learned today and more is available inside of the Picmonic learning system. So what are you waiting for? Go to Picmonic.com today and try it for free and find out why over 100,000 students are learning smarter, learning faster, and remembering it longer with fun pictures using Picmonic.